One of the largest school districts in the state is preparing to bring its high school students back to the classroom full time. And they say they're confident they have a plan in place to do that safely. Ross Gadotti is live at Hempfield High School with what the district is calling a phased in return. Ross. Yeah, the district basically puts it this way. They believe at this point in time with the vaccinations being available and other factors that it's safer and more practical to let the kids come back to school. First came the elementary students, then the middle schoolers. Now it's time for Hempfield area high school students to hit the books in the classroom five days a week. Everything is coming together. The district announcing a phased in return of high school students. March 26, the seniors arrive. March 30th, the juniors. April 7th, the sophomores. And April 9th, the freshmen. Our goal is to get as many students into the classroom as we can with the six feet social distancing to fill those available seats. It's likely there'll be more students than seats available in some classes, but the district says they have a plan for that. And in the event there's not space, we're going to use overflow areas. So this will be a supervised area within the school where the students can then um, complete their work virtually. But why open up five days a week in classroom instruction while the pandemic is still going on? The district superintendent Tammy Wolick says teacher vaccinations and reduced community spread numbers make the move both safe and practical. Dr. Wolick says 400 students have opted to stay home and continue the district cyber program for now, which actually assists in the process. So what that allows is for more of our students to be able to um, have a seat in our classroom. Whether it be in the classroom, in the hallway, in the gym, walking around the ca uh, campus, one thing is for sure, masks and social distancing will remain in force. Reporting live, Ross Gidotti, KDKA News.